Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am with my mom. Hello. And me. We're heading out east to Wading River to go pumpkin picking. So it's the real Sunday fun day, fall day. It's the second to last weekend before Halloween. But next weekend on Saturday, I'm going to Sleepy Hollow with my friend Marissa. So uh, stay tuned for a vlog on that. But we're just listening to the Bob Marley jams, driving on the LIE out to Wading River. Huh? No, we saw the animals up on these last time. Oh, oh the animals go on those. I yeah. Think the people go no, on those. No, the animals. Yeah. They could climb up them and walk around. Wow, last year when we came here, it was so crowded. It was crazy. Look, look, aw, oh, they're just standing here. Hi, guys. <laughs> oh, look at the, a donkey. Look. Janet and her sweet son Dominic, the donkey. Oh, is it Dominic the donkey? Hi. Please watch Flash fingers. fingers. We, we like, like to nibble. nibble. So here we are at the farm. We're currently at the petting zoo. Not really. It's not really a petting zoo. I don't think it's about to pet them. Yeah, no, it's a barnyard. Barnyard. So you kind of just walk by and you could see all the different kinds of animals. Right now we're seeing the donkeys. And here's goats. Aww, they're cute. I think this one's Dominic. See in the picture it's smaller. They're just big in general. Yeah. Hi guys. You have some kind of shooting range or something here? Oh jeez. That would be terrible. Sad. Here's the deer. Come on, the mom's probably going to like hold it. Here's the deer again. Maybe that's not hers. That one looks like this one. Oh, they are just too cute. I want one. Look at these little guys. I know. Oh my god, they're like the size of the cat. They're like the size of Gordo. Yeah. I tell you that. Baby. 
Here we are, entering the corn maze. It cuts down on the wind quite a bit. Oh yeah. This is nice. What's that? I'm scared. <laughs> I think this is a pretty mild corn maze. The one Marissa and I went to a few weeks ago was like actually, we got lost in it and I was really scared. Oh really? Yeah. But I, I remember this one being pretty tame. This is lovely. That's very lovely. So we just completed the corn maze. Now we're gonna pick our pumpkins over here and probably leave. <laughs> it's very windy. Like, it's a nice day, but it's just like windy and kind of chilly. Cold, windy. I mean, it is the end of October now, so. It's getting chilly on the farm. <laughs> but we did everything. We did the barnyard. We did the corn maze. And now we're going to pick pumpkins. And that's all we really came here to do. There's like, what? There's like hay rides and bounce houses. But th those are more for like kids. So. We did everything, so I feel good. So we're all done and headed home. We had a very fun time. It was mom's first time there. Mom, your thoughts? I liked it very much. It would have been better if it was a little less windy, but it was still a lot of fun. The corn maze was good. Nice and warm. And they had all sorts of animals. It was actually very interesting. It was my second time there, but it was a lot of fun. I love that place. I love stuff like this fall, you know, with the corn maze. And they had a bunch of animals and the pumpkin patch. Sorry if the audio is a little uh, hard to hear at parts because it was very windy, as you could see. Oh, here's the hot dog truck. Yeah. Serving. Um, yeah, but it was like very windy, like I have my winter coat on and like a hat and I have like a fleece and a sweater on under this, like I have like three layers. So it was definitely like very cold out. It actually, we were saying it felt so nice in the corn maze, because yes, since the corn was, no was so wind. tall, it was like we were blocked it was out. Blocker, that was yeah, cool. so that was good. But yeah, so we got one big pumpkin for us. We got a smaller pumpkin that we're gonna bring to my aunt's house for her. Um, we got like a little tiny pumpkin just cause it was cute. And then mom got some mums. Mums for mom. <laughs> and yeah, I think that's all we got. Oh, and a little scarecrow. Like, where are you gonna stick that out in the front? I'm just gonna stick it next to the front door, yeah. Yeah. Like in that area. That'll be and cute. I'm not gonna put the mums out. Because they're saying, I heard, there's a frost warning. Oh God. And they said for all plants to bring them in. So I'm yeah. not planting that, Mom. I'll just, if it gets warm, I'll put it outside in the pot. But otherwise, it's staying on the kitchen table. It's very weird. This past week here on Long Island. Oh, this is nice. Um, nice, like, houses. Um, yeah, this past week, like... I swear, like towards the beginning of the week, it was literally in like the mid 70s. And then one day it just dropped and now it's been in like the 40s, maybe the 50s. Like it just got very cold out of nowhere. And I feel like that's usually the case, but it's kind of weird cause it is like the end of October. And I feel like it's more in like the beginning of October. It's, it gets cold. Like I feel like September is still really hot. Like summery, it like 80s. Like now should be Indian summer. What like is that? When you get that last burst oh. of hot weather. No, I feel like that's always like the end of September. Yeah, and well. by October it's cold, but this whole October so far has been pretty warm. Well, this so. week was freezing. So. Yeah, and then out of nowhere this week, now it like, but that's what happens. It always just drops. Like it's always so nice. You could still wear like a light sweater and then it just drops and you gotta break out your winter coats. Uh, we both got our winter coats on. Which I would have liked to have gotten in dry clean. But yeah. No way I can do it now. I didn't have time either. Here. So, yeah, that's that's pretty much the vlog for this week. But 
I think it's cute. You got to see our little trip out to Wading River, which, Mom, you said you've never been, I've right? I've never been. My first so time in my life to Wading River and Ridge. Still have not encountered Middle Island, but we'll leave that for another day. Yeah, it's so weird because I, I was saying this earlier how there's so many towns on Long Island and like some of them you've been to a hundred times and some of them you've like never been to in your life and like my mom has like lived. <laughs> That's funny. Well, I'm not saying it in a bad way, but obviously you're like much older than me. Like I'm only like 23. Yes, I'm 40 years older than you. And it's I, like even I've you've never been to some towns. Mm -hmm. That's just like how crazy it is. Yeah. And Long Island, I mean, it's a decent size, but it ain't that big. Like it's not like the state of Pennsylvania where it would like make sense. If you haven't been everywhere, it takes like five hours to drive through. But that's the vlog for this week. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye guys.